morning. Uh, I've decided, um, because I'm, I've got a busy day, I've just popped in my local wood, which is a five minute walk with a dog. Um, Arts lays. With the very minimal gear, literally just got the, the Canon M3, uh, got the drone on the back, uh, just going to fly it in the field, and I'm really looking for a bit of woodland photography, but I know this morning there's a little bit of mist, the sun's coming through, so I was hoping for them, a uh, few sun rays as it hits the trees. Probably not as misty as what I like, but I'm hoping the mist will still roll through. See if we can get um, a nice image, really. I've even forgot my mic and everything. But I thought I'd do the, the vlog just because it's such a nice morning. To be Turn back this way. Um, so, I'm going to walk up to the field, get the drone out, fly the drone, and uh, See if I can capture some when I walk back through the woods. Um, blue bells are nearly out. Won't be long now, another couple of weeks I think, and there'll be, uh, be a carpet of blue. So there's photos there, and I'm checking them out for when I come in in another couple of weeks. I always like to get me blue bells. So yeah, just a little bit of morning fun, really. First shot in the bag. I'm just really trying out to my camera as much as anything because I've not really used it in um, in the field <laughs> besides for vlogging. So I uh, thought I'd come and learn a bit more about it, um, see how good it is or how bad it is, and uh, oh, sorry. I thought I'd send the composition then. Hmm. Um, yeah, take a few more shots with it and see how it comes out. As you can see, it's one of them, it's not as, not quite got the mist that I wanted. But still getting them nice beams of light, which is what I'm after. Uh, through the drone pretty boring to be honest um, uh, yes yeah, so I'm just uh, taking a track through the woods normally go off the beaten path you get some lovely uh, monk jack deer around here um, and uh, obviously squirrels unfortunately not Red ones. Um, nice to get loads of woodpecker you can hear. Every time I seem to walk it through here without my camera, I see one. Every time I bring my camera, you got it. Right, so just so. let's try and get another shot then. This is um, I've come up here because I know the sun sort of beats through the trees here, early morning. So I'm hoping to just get another beam of light bursting through. And it's because it's, it's lower down, it's a little bit more, look at that little bit more mist. So let's try and uh, find something. Got a couple of shots. Um, went low down as a interesting point of view with the wet grass, and there was a, there was a log there, sort of as your focal point. 
So uh, we'll get back and have a look at it. Looks nice on the back of the camera anyway. So um, I'm just glad I get out to be honest. Um, yeah, so I went, went to F11 first. A little play with that then. I've, I've also gone right down to this lens will only go down to uh, 3.5 I think it is. So I went down to 3.5, 3.5. Um, just to sort of focus on that foreground but uh, in the grand background we've still got them um, sun rays which is what I was trying to, to get um, just to create a bit of arty farty right dogs had a good walk 